Hello everyone and welcome to this channel. By the way, I'm Eduardo Golpan and to this video I'm gonna show you on how to insert a Windows Media Player and also on how to resize it. Because resizing the Windows Media Player guys is not always as easy as double click. So now let us start. Let's go to create menu. Form design, but before we insert the Windows Media Player, I have to set this to yes to make the form um, clear. Okay, this one, and here we go. So, this is it. Now, this is the time to insert. Click this, guys, arrow down, active X control, and now let us find the Windows Media Player. This one, click OK, and this is it. So, let's try. Oh, a small one. So, let's try to operate this. So, delete. And I will rename this to file name. And I will add a play button. And guys, if you want to insert a browse button here for the file path, uh, you can watch my video about that how to create a file dialog box and I will also put the link below so that you can watch it uh, directly so let's go back again okay this one now uh, let us create a code this is just only a one line code guys so code builder click ok so remember the name the name of this by the way is mid windows media player I will copy and then me that so I will paste that URL now equals me that file name that value that's it save from one click OK all right close and let's try by the way I have here a name of my videos like for example this one tutorial for navigation error how to handle sorry this supposedly okay and play so it's working guys how about this one hello everyone and welcome to this channel into this video I so find out successfully and that's it and then another sample guys so it's really working guys so now the question is how to resize this one so now let us resize this by the way as I've said earlier um, resizing this uh, Windows Media Player is not always as easy as double click because if we drag this just like this one and then click save and form view so as you can see it returns to its original size again even if we set this straight stupid to yes and save still it returns to its original size so what shall we do now as you can see there is a blank a beacon space so we will double click this double click and now nothing's happen but as you can see it's blank now let's click again this and then click design view sorry design view so there is a small blank space so double click and then finally here we go guys so this is what we need the windows media player properties not this property as you can see straight stupid no straight stupid so we will check this one and apply click ok here we go then we have to drag let us drag ok this one and then save close open again as you can see guys so 
it's uh, bigger. Now let us try. Let us insert a video. It's really working. How about this one? Okay, that's all guys. I hope this video helps you a lot. If you have some questions, you know what to do. You can just comment down below. And if you have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe. That's all. Thank you and see you to my next video.